Who is it? Oh, it's you! Trick or treat? Oh, well, come right in. Come right in. Welcome. Are you? You were expecting me to say foolish mortals, weren't you? <laughs> oh, Chucky, shut up. Chucky, are you paying? Well, me too, but you know. As a dog, I'm infamous. I'm one of the most notorious slashers in history, and I don't want to get that up. Well, the these people are our guests today. This is our Halloween ep Chucky, it's the Halloween episode. I, I know you do, but could you, could you not stab him until at least we're done with the episode? Chucky's so. He's had it. He's, he's ready. He's a, I know. There's a limit I can take, too. I've had it all summer long. But, you know, just relax. Okay. As we come a little further into our humble... Oh, look at this. Isn't he nice? Hi. Yes. Do you have treats for us? What a good boy. The perfect thing for this is to have a candy bowl down in the middle, and the kids can reach down. They can reach down and get their candy, and, and then uh, 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 they get smacked by the hands. Good man. <laughs> Nibbles, my friend. I see you. You can't escape my game. So why don't you come a little closer and let's play a game. <laughs> if you win, you get a prize. If you lose, well, don't say I didn't warn you. <laughs> Nibbles follows you. Warning, don't touch me. I've been watching you for a while now. I hope you don't mind. I like the way you walk. I can't help but follow you around with my gaze. You have a certain bounce in your step that's just so enticing. You gotta be careful when you walk around here. Oh. They're triplets. Isn't that nice? Oh. Brownie the bear. Hi, Brownie. Notice how balanced he is. Well, after we leave Brownie, maybe we come over here and we see if we have any treats in the bowl. I don't know. Oh, oh. <laughs> Who do we have up here? It was before they kicked me. You know, this guy here with the cards usually likes to come alive first. Well, there he is. And not enough. I have to find out. I am here. <laughs> Look at the witch. <laughs> oh, there goes the sea hag. Somebody said the sea hag reminds them of the witch in Snow White. See the apple? She's similar, but all these witches, they all have that same type of that appeal. Frankie, I don't even want to talk to you. You look like you're in a mood. Uh-oh. It's Halloween. 
Halloween invasion. What could be more wholesome than a guy holding a chainsaw and a cut off hand? Look. Don't forget to duck. Uh, or you'll be a dead duck. <laughs> <laughs> Well, he's a friendly sort. He really is friendly. What is this guy up here? Is he the ringleader? My friends are going to show you a scary good time. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you say, kid. You know, Frank is one of my favorites up here. Would the Martian please leave me alone for a little bit? You gotta watch his eyes. You know, I gotta tell you, Frank has his eye on you when you come in here. He's really pretty good. The eye movement, even the blinking of the eyes, is truly amazing. You remember Cousin It, don't you? Hi, Cuz. You gotta watch out as you round the bend here. Over this way. He might be sleeping, we might get by. Oh! Baba! Baba! What's wrong with you? Back! Down, boy! Down! Down! Bobby! <laughs> I found some scissors to cut me down from here, and then I'll string you up in my place. Why, it's as simple as that. We'll have so much fun together. At least, I will. <laughs> Look at this guy, digging graves again. So, you're wondering what I'm doing out here in the dead of night, hey? Well, what does it look like? I'm robbing some graves, obviously. Now, are you gonna grab a shovel and help me or not? I just might split the spoils with you. <laughs> <laughs> so when I get free, I'll show you what I'm doing. I'm gonna fix him good. He's gonna bump his head with this block of wood. <laughs> Let that be a lesson, kids. Don't be a blockhead. It's always so nice to have a public service message. Good. PSA. Batty! Batty! How are you tonight, Batty? Batty, please don't be such a little mouth. I'm sure our guests are looking for three bucks, Rick. <laughs> You know, Batty, you really do remind me of Gene Rayburn. Do you remember Gene Rayburn on Match Game? He was great. He used to do a great Dracula imitation. And he had the long tongue for it. And he used to go, blah, 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 he bite you in the neck. The Dracula said, and he go, blah, blah. Gene Rayburn was the best. I always loved Gene. Right, Batty? The only thing you have to fear is fear. That's true. <laughs> who said that? Do you remember who said that? Wasn't that Teddy? Hey, do I look Teddy sad Roosevelt. Or what? I must be the only guy you know that shaves with a chainsaw. <laughs> <laughs> now it was Teddy who said speak softly and carry big stick, but it was Franklin who said the only thing we have to fear is fear itself. The only thing you have to fear is fear itself. There we go. He knows his history. Oh my God. The witch didn't say anything for us. What's going on, Batty? Shut up, Batty. Oh. Welcome to the dark. Magic, magic, magic. <laughs> there is no escape. <laughs> so now, love, 
Well, thank you, Grandma. Can everybody have one of those potions? I think every trick-or-treater should have one, don't you? You know, we almost passed the pumpkin head here. <laughs> I call him a pumpkin head because he reminds me of a pumpkin. He's got a bucket full of cotton candy. And if his control box was working, which it is not, I have to fix it. In the cotton candy bin, up will come the head and he will say something very, very apropos, like, happy Halloween to everybody. Oh, fear, fear itself, we know, we know. What are you gonna do? Guys, did we scare you? Oh my God, this guy's not gonna shut up. Well, we better end it here, because we gotta go out and start trick-or-treating. It's Halloween, happy Halloween, kids. We'll see you next time from the Main Street, Randy Land, YouTube channel. Boo! <laughs>